In this video, I'm going to explain how we can solve simultaneous equations using the replacement method or the substitution method. If you want to see how to use the elimination method, you can use see it, watch another video for that. But this is the, the replacement method. So we've got two equations, 3x plus 2y equals 26 and x plus y equals 16. Now what I'm going to do is rearrange the second equation because from that we can see that y will equal 16 take away x. Basically I've taken away x from each side to end up with an equation y equals 16 minus x. Now I'm going to use this to replace the y in the first equation and you'll see the effect of this. So rewriting that first equation I get 3x plus two lots of and y this time is 16 take away x and that will equal 26. So let's expand the brackets. So we've got 3x and we'll have plus 32 take away 2x that will equal 26. So what I've actually achieved is an equation all in terms of x. So simplifying this, this equation now I've got x plus 32 equals 26 and solving that equation gives me I take away 32 from each side I end up with x will equal minus 6. If I go back to the second equation, it's easy in that equation, I'll have in place of the x I've got minus 6 plus y equals 16 so y must be 22. So the whole approach here is to end up with one unknown in an equation and work with that. And we do that by rearranging our second equation here. And now continue with the second example just to reinforce the, the approach. Again, we're going to take the second equation. I'm going to rearrange this so y will equal 18 take away 2x. I've basically taken away 2x from each side of this equation to end up with y equals 18 take away 2x. And now I'm going back to the first equation. So I've got 5x plus two lots of y, well y we've discovered is 18 take away 2x and that will equal 44. So once again we've got 5x, we're now going to expand the brackets so we get 36 take away 4x that equals 44. Tidying this up, simplifying it, we get x plus 36 equals 44. Take away 36 from each side leads us to x will equal 8. Now going back to the, the second equation, if x is 8 then 2x here will be 16 and 16 plus y will equal 18 so y will simply equal 2.